Just look at the law on its face. It doesn't provide a lot of details that will help voters understand what it means when the new law goes into effect on November 6th. I, I think it'll be a good amount of, you know, you know, greeting people, uh, just making sure things run smoothly, and uh, you know, just preventing any irregularity. I believe we're monitoring um, the elections just to make sure that uh, no one gets pulled out unnecessarily, or if there's any, I guess, problems with voter registration, that we raise them and bring them to the, I guess, Committee of 70. Voters that come to the polls will be asked by polling place officials to show their photo ID. If they have it, or even if they don't have it, they can still vote on the voting machines. But if you don't bring an acceptable form of ID to the polls on November 6th, you will have to vote by provisional, which is a paper ballot. So voters know about the requirements of the voter ID law and are prepared about what they need to do in order to get a photo ID to vote in November.